I'm like ball headed. All right, what's up, YouTube? Um, this is the very first day of the apartment vlog or whatever. So right now we're gonna get ready to go and look at an apartment and hopefully we get accepted to into the apartment and then I'm gonna start recording from there. But yeah, I'm super excited. Um, I hope everything goes to plan. I'm really excited because growing up, like, you know, your parents are always in charge of you, but when you get older, you have to learn, like you gotta make decisions for yourself and not for other people. And like, no matter what you think anybody's gonna say, like about your decision, you have to stay true and do what you wanna do basically with precaution. But you know, life's too short to not go for what you wanna go for. So if you wanna do something, you need to do it and plan for it and manifest it because if not, you're just gonna be stuck in the wishing phase. But yeah, y'all, super excited. I cannot wait to see where God takes me this year. Definitely feeling blessed. But yeah, y'all, don't let any of your past mistakes define y'all because there's always a way even when it seems like there's no way, so. All right, so um, I'm hearing some good news. We got accepted into the apartment. So you already know I'm about to go blow a bag. Like, I'm so excited. Like, I can't even believe that um, God really blessed me with this opportunity. Like, I can't believe it. This is my, this is my like real first like lease apartment. And just to know like it's mine, like it's something I can call my home. It just means a lot to me. So I'm just like so excited. But I'm definitely excited to take y'all on this journey with me because I really wanted to start my YouTube channel back up to just show like the reality of like the real world. Like, you know, not somebody who's like, you know, just show y'all like from starting from the bottom, now we here. It's like, I'm, a, I'm just so excited to show y'all the journey life takes me on and like, you know, just really take y'all on this journey and like be 100% blunt, 100% honest, 100% truthful with everything. I just can't wait to really take it to the next level like this seems small but it's like so big because it's just like you know life really be life in sometimes and like you know it, you gotta cherish the W you should get out of the hella losses life brings you you know like after that with all that being said it's really just appreciating the W's life brings and you know like just knowing that everything's gonna be okay regardless of like what the circumstances look like you know just not letting your past define your future and that's what I'm so big on I'm so big on living life as well like take the risk take the chances because you never know where it can take you if you have the desire to do something you need to do it because obviously that's your calling in life but I didn't want to make this into like all of that talking and stuff but like when I be in the spirit, I be in the spirit. And I, like I said, I'm truly thankful for this. Like, y'all, I literally was getting some food and I'm trying to, uh, I was trying to pay. She said our system is down, it's your lucky day. I just got some free food. Uh, what the, as soon as I'm talking about, as soon as I talk about, uh, you know the blessings and stuff i get some free food that's how you know that just confirmed that we on the way to elevating like i don't care what nobody says that was a sign so yeah now i'm after i gulp this down a little bit i'm gonna um, go inside the store you got five below in here you know five below we have some cute stuff hopefully i can find some fake plants in there but i'm gonna go to marshall's first and then, yeah, so I'm gonna hit y'all up in Marshalls. Did it over text, didn't call me. Still got love for your mommy. I know you wanna be somebody, even if you gotta leave somebody. It's our girl, it's our day. Most of the things I don't wanna say. I won't be around while you chase. Yes, I'm hurting, yes, I'm 
shady. All right, y'all. So I'm headed to Burlington right now. I'm gonna go to Five Below, but I really need to go get some gas. Cause yeah, there's a Burlington over here, a Dollar Tree. I really want to go get the cleaning supplies today too. But Burlington, I'm really looking for that black thing that has the white letters on it and like maybe something for the bath the bathroom but we're i'm definitely gonna be shopping all next week let me slow down i'm gonna just park in front of dollar tree are these speed bumps or what i'm just gonna go to dollar tree first and then i'm gonna go to burlington and then I'm gonna be making a lot more trips to cause this I'm on I'm not on my side of town right now. I'm all the way over here. So there's different stuff at different stores. Right now I'm just focused on like trying to put some type of decorations in it. So I'm gonna get into Dollar Tree and I'm gonna update y'all when I get in. Okay y'all, there's Dollar Tree and then there's <clears throat> Burlington's over there. So I'm gonna try to see what's in here. is walmart then i'm finna go to the apartment and i gotta go to work at five so i got the oh, mama hair stuff i got all this stuff so yeah and then really we gonna be going shopping like all next week all next weekend and it's by then it should be like enough stuff to where it's like okay i'll call it home so yeah, that's what I'm about to do. And then I'm gonna show you everything that I got, how much it costs. I kept the receipts. When I get there, or yeah, I'm gonna just do when I get there because I know I'm gonna wanna put the stuff up. So yeah. All right, y'all have to excuse the way I look because I gotta go to work. But I have some stuff from Burlington's Marshalls and Walmart. It's crooked. At Walmart, I spent a whopping $77.76. This That's not gonna load, but here's the receipt for Walmart. Okay, so first, you know, we have the, I didn't even see that this was lavender, but I wanted to get some Comet. Then I got some Pine Soul, 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 however you say it. Got some Lysol, um, toilet bowl cleaner. Then I got some Clorox cleaner. Don't even use that. I really just use soap and water and wash the brush and products, but yeah. This, this wrapping broke, but this is an incense holder and like, you know, it's a regular stick incense holder and then it has the ones that are like cone shaped. So that's that. Then I got this, um, I don't know why I forgot, paper towel holder. And then, I got some Clorox disinfectant wipes. You know I have to get the sponges. This is scrubber for to clean the bathroom. Got some scrubbers for the sink. I was looking for a boom, but I guess OxyClean was the only fun whatever. And then I got some glass cleaner. And then of course I have to get the Dawn. This wash and the And then I got this as well. So for all of this, I really think that this was um, pretty good. What is this? Yeah. 12 toilet paper and six um, paper towels. So that's that from Walmart. Y'all need to save y'all's bags. Sorry. 
Okay, so we're going to start off with these two things in my bar. They're the exact same type of candle. So I got those two because the color scheme is going to be black and white. So. And then I got these glasses. Just to start off, that's just some more shoes. Okay, oh no. I got this ice cube tray, but I didn't know we had an ice maker already, but we're still gonna use this. So let me get this over here because I gotta wash these. Okay. Now I'm gonna show you what I got from Burlington and how much that costs. So from Burlington, it's probably the most expensive. Um, $113.52, but I did get a lot of stuff. I think that that's pretty good. So um, I really just got some bathroom stuff along with some decor. This, I got these, these are so cute. I've been seeing these everywhere. And, these right here cost like $30 on Amazon, so I'm glad that I got that too. Um, I got the shower curtain, and then I got the liner, and then some hooks to go with it. So that's that. And you know, I have to get the matching set. So I don't want to do too much black in the bathroom. I, I still want to have like mostly white because I don't really want it to be like, depressing. But yeah, I got these. Toothbrush holder and a soap holder. And then I got this. Um, it's not broken. It's a toilet brush. Toilet bowl cleaner. And I got this for the bathroom as well. Silver or white flowers. And of course, you know, I have to start off by getting a quote. I live by motivational quotes. It says, be strong, you never know who you're inspiring. Not even just be strong, but like keep doing you because you never know who's watching and who can get inspired by your story and your life. That's how I take it as. And then I got two more items. I got this little thing. Ooh, to show my whole little setup. Um, it's like a little tray for when we get our coffee table, but I might end up sitting on this island right here. And then I have the mats to go in the bathroom. So that's it for today. This is probably gonna be one video in itself, and then I'm gonna probably update y'all when it's like fully furnished and like you know like a in life you know first apart first apartment whatever but yeah y'all so so excited to put this stuff together and i will see y'all later all right you guys so it is now the middle of july and i recorded that part in late may early june I told you guys I wanted to keep it as realistic as possible. I'm not gonna lie, those two months, one month, whatever, flew by extremely fast. Like, I've just been working so much this summer. But today is the day that we go furniture shopping. So I'm super excited about that. We're gonna go with my mom and my sister. So, like I said, I'm keeping it as real as possible. We're not getting, we haven't had furniture since we first moved in. I basically got the necessities and kept it pushing right hand on the bottle but I'm super excited that we're going to be going to look for a couch and we might be looking for a dining table and the chairs too I'm not sure what we're gonna get but we're just gonna go to somewhere up the street and just look at that so yeah like I said keeping it as real as possible you're not gonna have everything you need probably about the first couple of months you know you're not gonna have everything realistically like you're just not like it's not gonna be perfect it's not gonna be fairy tale land life is real it's not fake so don't go so hard on yourself if you don't have everything if you don't have the money for it 
or if you just don't have everything together like you thought you were like you've seen these people move in they have everything like you know it's so unrealistic to expect everything out of yourself so i'm gonna get right into it i'm gonna hit y'all back up whenever we get into the store and yeah okay we just bought our first couch <laughs> and he sold it to us home zone, what's your name edison home zone and then come visit us come visit him man. they have great prices only fifty dollars down come get you some come get you one and we got this the child in the back yeah. just crying but we're not gonna look <laughs> right cps call cps <laughs> Hey guys, it's the next day and this is what it's looking like right now. So I'm gonna have to like move all of this stuff, like this general area, out the way so they can come deliver the furniture and set it up. Um, I do have a client this morning, so I'm gonna try hard to do that, set up the hair, and then go from there. <laughs> Couch looks like the bookshelf and the table. So this is the couch. Per, I can't wait to get some um black, some black 
I don't know if I'm going to do gray. It was mostly black, like decorative pillows. And then this is the table. This is actually some seashells from when we were in Progressive. So, yeah. This is a super nice table. It's a pretty good size, so. Yeah. And this is the bookshelf. You have to forgive everything that's on the floor. It's for my nursing hall video, so stay tuned for that. But yeah, y'all. This is everything so far. I hope you enjoyed this video. And I will definitely be hitting you guys up. Too much light. I will be hitting you guys up later in the next video where I think I'll be going grocery shopping and some more shopping for the house. So yeah. Stay tuned. Be blessed. And remember, God loves you. Goodbye. Tell me how to have you seen her It was about five minutes ago When I seen the hottest chick that a young and never seen before I say yo, tell the girls I wanna meet her On second time that ain't the way to go I gotta deal with game